I've selected a song um, by Sun Little called Your Love Will Blow Me Away because Sun Little blows me away with his talent, his genius, his production. He, I think he's a brilliant artist that's current and I'm, I'm basically his number one fan. I've selected the song Good Man by Raphael Sadiq. Raphael Sadiq is a hero in my eyes of R&B music. And recently I was lucky enough to work with him LA, in LA. Good Man is an amazing video as well as being a wonderful song that draws upon retro influences but still kind of hits you where it's meant to hit you. I've picked Remember by the Shangri-Las because recently I was in a play by the Punch Drunk Theatre Group and National Theatre called The Drowned Man and on the playlist that was rotating every night was this song Remember by the Shangri-Las. I love that song, it really represents the 60s. I'm in love with that song. I selected Happy by Pharrell. I don't think it takes a genius to figure out why I've selected that song. It's a feel-good song, it's that simple. I've selected Back to Black by Amy because she was just a classic artist with a classic voice and her music and her voice will live on forever. And Back to Black, for me, is one of the most amazing songs to have come out in my lifetime that will last an eternity and will serve her memory in good stead. I've selected Dr. Pressure by Milo, which was a remix of a Gloria Estefan song. And I fell in love with that song because I was raving to it in Ibiza. And so it brings back good memories for me. And every now and again, you want to listen to that type of a song. There are so many more I could pick from, from, from that kind of era. But for me, I still like to listen to that tune. Jungle Juice by Mandingo is a brilliant instrumental funk track that um, crosses all the T's and dots all the I's in terms of funk music and really getting you for a 70s funk tune. Mary J. Blige, No More Pain. Mary J. Blige is one of my favourite artists. If I could have been born a different singer, I definitely would have chosen to be have her voice. That song gets me every time I listen to it. Mary is just a singer that just, you can feel the emotion whenever she sings, which is why she's so brilliant. And, and that song really strikes a chord with me. Children of the Revolution T-Rex. Every now and again, you've got to listen to a tune that's one of these tunes. And that song does that to me. It, once again, it really gets you. I chose Bohemian Rhapsody by Queen because when I was growing up, I was obsessed with Queen. I had every single one of their albums. I, I could have picked at least five more songs from, from Freddie and, and Queen. However, really, if you're going to pick a Queen song, you've got to go with the Bohemian Rhapsody because it just, you know, it answers all the questions. It's, it, it was groundbreaking at the time and it still is today. It's just an amazing piece of music.